Hi everyone, it's Dr. Keenan here. And many people have been wondering, what do I eat when I'm home at lockdown? You know, it's been kind of mocked and joked that COVID-19 is in 19 pounds of weight gain that people have while they're on lockdown. So I thought about the top three best things that you can do to try to avoid that. And if you have already started gaining it, then these are tips that can, can help you to think about some changes that you can start to make that can result in weight loss. So number one is water. You know, if you make water the fundamental thing in your home, if you start your day with water, you are going to start to see changes. Personally, myself and patients that I've been uh, counseling for weight loss over the years, the number one tip they always have is having a steady supply of water. Most people have a water jug with them if they go out. They'll have glasses of water around the house because when we drink water, number one, often we end up eating because we're thirsty. So number one, water gets rid of the, thir the, the thirst response so it's not food. Uh, water is cleansing for our bodies. Water actually can help to rev our metabolism because our, you know, remember our cells and our body is like 70% water. So if we have enough of it, it's gonna stimulate our mitochondria and it's just gonna make us burn more energy. So get your water, number one. Number two, the snacks. Okay, I am like anybody else. When things are in my house, I will eat them. So if you have a problem with something, do not bring it into your home whatever that may be. If you have kids, sure, you can bring them some healthy treats, but for many people even during lockdown, you still have the possibility that you go to a grocery store at certain times. So if you're gonna go to the grocery store, maybe get yourself a treat for that day, but don't bring large amounts of snacks into your home because it'll be inevitable. You're gonna get bored during lockdown and things are gonna happen. You're gonna get into that cupboard and the snacks are gonna happen. So what needs to happen is to have healthy snacks. So think of the things that you like. Maybe you like things in small little portions, like I have little bags in my house, little bags of pistachios. I love to keep dark chocolate. Um, of course, fruit is another wonderful um, snack that you can have, some um, you know, Greek yogurts, that sort of thing. So think about if you're gonna be snacking, what it is that you want to snack on and make it just a healthier choice. And the third thing that I have to think about when you're home at stay at home is the hours that you eat, the, um, the window of your eating hour. Because you know, when you're at work, often you, know, you have scheduled times for breaks, for supper and, or lunch and supper. But when you're home, there's the access to the kitchen at any time of the day. So one of my friends told me what they did is they put a sign on their fridge that kitchen is closed at 7 p.m. So maybe that's something that can work for you. Many people will actually do what's called intermittent fasting. Now this is an advanced step for people that are actually wanting to lose weight or intermittent eating, I'd like to, I, to call it, or timed eating where you eat like in a, an eight hour window or a 10 hour window. So say you're gonna decide we're gonna have breakfast at nine and have our last meal at five. Or maybe if you, even if you go from eight to six, but we know that those shorter eating hours are good for our body. What it's doing actually is giving our body uh, time to rest. It's gonna lower our insulin because we're not eating constantly. So think about that uh, as what's going on right now as you're staying at home. So remember, water, the snacks you bring into your home, and the eating hour window. So please share for me, it would be wonderful to see your top tips of how you've been able to maintain food and your weight during this time of lockdown. As always, wishing you love, joy, and bliss. See you soon. Bye for now.